A new report published in Science Magazine claims worldwide fish stocks may run out by 2048. By then, the study says, populations of harvestable fish species will collapse. Dr. Jeremy Jackson of the Scripps Institute of Oceanography in La Jolla, California, contributed to this report. In 2001, he was lead author of the first of several studies that drew attention to the damages of overfishing. National Geographic spoke with Dr. Jackson two years after that study was published. Well, I think that, that the notion that we can somehow keep hunting and gathering in the oceans without limit to feed six billion people is just pretty stupid. We will never be able to fish at the level we've been fishing. Jackson's earlier two-year study set out to trace the decline of many ocean species over several centuries. He and a team of international scientists identified overfishing as more destructive to the ocean than toxic pollution or degrading water quality. The damage is close to complete and it's almost certainly reversible, or at least mostly reversible, but what it requires is a utterly different attitude about how we use the ocean. As Jackson sees it, the remedy for restoring marine ecosystems has to be drastic. I think we have to protect a third or 40% uh, or in some cases half of the ocean from fishing for certain species. Jackson says the off-limits approach will allow fish populations to rebound. The solution is scientifically sound, but politically difficult. Are we willing to set aside um, a very large part of the ocean and just not let anybody go there? I and mean, it would take all the navies of the world to pretend to enforce those regulations. We need to have the courage to make difficult decisions that will hurt people for the protection of the resource for the future. Currently in the U.S., Congress is reviewing laws that restrict overfishing and bring scientists into the decision-making process. The report's findings echo Jackson's earlier conclusions that marine ecosystems can be restored and success depends on setting areas aside from human encroachment. It seems now more than ever, time is of the essence to save the bounty of the sea.